So to provide clothing, we have a clothing boutique, which uh, is set up very much in the style of a shop, um, which allows residents to come and have a browse with the clothing that we have and allows them to choose and find things that they like as they would um, at home in a real shop. So it's all about trying to create the same environment that they're used to. It works on a rotation basis, so each week is dedicated to a different group of the camp. So, for example, this current week is men's week, so um, all the clothes we have in here are for men. And at the end of each week, we'll take all the stock out and replace it with stock for the next week. So, for example, next week will be women's week, um, so only for women, and the following week, children. Which is quite nice because it allows to come in and they can shop in a sort of a safe environment, where they have time to choose and have a laugh with their friends. So it's a, it's a comfortable environment for them. When the new boutique opens, we go round to the caravans on site and give out tickets to each individual, which allows them to come to the boutique either that morning or that afternoon in an allotted time where they can come in either on their own or in their group and they have time to browse and to choose. So because we don't open the shop, to everyone all at once. It's very nice because it does give that extra time and um, keeps it sort of a peaceful process. We also restock the boutique every day, which ensures that it's not that those who come at the end get fewer clothes. The system works very well because the warehouse have a great way of um, organising all the clothes. So when it comes to restock, uh, all the clothes are categorised according to age and gender. So it's very easy to select the right amount to bring for next week's shop. And we can ensure that we have enough to cater for all the sizes and ages that will be coming that week. To donate, please go to refugeesupport.eu. Thank you.